hello everyone welcome back in today's lecture i am going to explain about the drilling machines its classification and the various drilling machines used in previous lecture we discussed about the drilling machine and the introduction to drilling machine then the classification of drilling machine after that classification i also explain about the specification of drilling machine then about this portable drilling machine and this sensitive or bench type drilling machine you can see in the figure that is the normally used now let me explain about the upright drilling machine so upright drills similar to sensitive drills have power feed mechanism for rotating drills and are designed for heavier work what is the difference between upright and heavier work is drilling as well as drill. now what is the main feature it is also used for tapping purpose as well as drilling purpose and here the another difference is the box column machine is more rigid than a round column machine so uh instead of using round we use the box column machine in the upright drilling next uh, drilling machine is radial drilling machine radial drilling machine is used to perform the drilling operation on work piece which are too heavy and also may be too large to mount them on work table of vertical spindle drilling machine now what happens in radial drilling machine to perform the drilling operation on work piece which are too heavy and maybe too large to mount on work table of vertical spindle drilling it consists of a heavy base and vertical column with a long horizontal or radial arm extending from it and can be rapidly raised lowered and swing in horizontal plane about the main column to any of the desired location here you can see this complete radial arm is possible we can slide this portion as well as or we can swing this portion as well as or we can move it up or down position as well as so the radial arm and here the another the other parts are the same for example here the motor for the spindle drill head for feed hand wheel then spindle drill column here there is the elevating screw the whole portion we can here uh, hold and move it to the required position desired location the drilling head can be moved to and fro along the arm and can be swiveled only in universal radial drilling machine to drill hole at an angle so what is the main feature we can drill a hole at an angle by rotating this and the drilling head can be moved to and fro here from in this direction and can be swiveled which means in this direction the combination of motions of radial arm and drilling head offer a great deal of flexibility in moving drill to any position with this it is very much useful for it gives very much flexibility in moving the drill to any position now the main advantage of radial drilling machine is that the drilling can be carried out on heavy work pieces in any position without moving them so so the main advantage will be that what will be the main advantage that the drilling can be carried out on heavy work piece in any position without moving that which means we do not have to clamp and unclamp the work piece repeatedly we have to only move the radial arm this type of drilling machine is used in tool rooms and large scale die manufacturing units now what are the where it is used 
the tool rooms where the major machines are used and the large scale die manufacturing units where we want to manufacture the large die for casting where we can use the radial drilling machine then there is the gang drilling machine when the several drilling spindle are mounted on a single table here instead of single drilling we have the multiple drills that's why it is called as gang drill so what is the difference between other drill and gang drill we use several drilling spindle here you can see multiple there are many number of drills we can use and it can be of any arrangement in circular or in this position as well and the dry mechanism can be individual or it can be served through a single motor as well as in this type of drill each of these spindles can be independently set for different speed and depth of cut here what we can do we can independently set the different speed and different depth of cut such machine are useful when the number of holes of different size are to be drilled on the same workpiece which means that the when we are supposed to machine we can uh, when such machines are very much useful when the number of holes of different size are to be drilled on the same workpiece on the same workpiece we have to uh, drill the number of holes apart from drilling a number of machine other machine operation like reaming counterboring tapping can also be used at a time on this machine so what is the benefit of using gang uh, drilling suppose there is one part and it is required to dr drill multiple holes at the same times so for reducing the time we can use this gang drilling machine so we can uh, the number of holes using this gang drilling machine another drilling machine is turret drilling machine likewise in turret lathe uh, turret machine overcomes the floor space restrictions caused by the gang drilling and a six turret nc drill press is shown in the figure the stations are set up with a variety of tools and nc control is also available two fixtures can be located side by side on the work work table thus permitting locating and unloading of one part while the other part is being machined this reduces the machine cycle so here the what is the main thing in this turret drilling machine is we can use number of tools here you can see this is the six tool mounted turret so we can use various operations using this turret and without wasting our time for changing that tool so the station are set up with variety of tools and two fixtures can be located side by side on the workpiece so this is about the turret drilling machine then there is deep hole drilling machine uh, these machines are used for drilling holes whose depth exceeds normal drill size when the depth is large then we have if suppose we wants to uh, produce a very deep hole then we can use this specially designed machine these machine are operated at high speed and low feed the feed here is provided is low but the we can say the speed of operation is high uh, because the speed of rotation will be high these machine are either horizontal or vertical depending upon the requirement we can use the horizontal or vertical the work or the drill may be revolved uh, what happens in the vertical we have to revolve the work uh, that will be also more beneficial if we revolve the work it is possible in the horizontal 
or maybe in the vertical most machine are of horizontal construction as a center cut gun drill which has a single cutting point cutting edge with a straight flute running through its length now uh, most of the machines are why horizontal because the center cut gun drill can be used and it have which has a single cutting edge with straight flute running through its length then oil under high pressure is forced to cutting edge through a lengthwise hole in the drill here the oil under high pressure is forced to cutting edge through a lengthwise hole in the drill in gun drilling the feed must be light to avoid deflection and the drill and the causing it to minder through it length now these machine are very useful for drilling deep holes in rifle travel or crankshaft you might have seen the rifle which has a very long shaft hollow and we can use this machine for drilling it and also for crankshaft we can also use this type of deep hole drilling machine next is multi swindler drilling machine these machine are very vertical type when the they permit drilling of several holes of different diameter simultaneously suppose the diameter is varying so we need to change the cutting tool so instead of that the we can have the multi spindle in which the tool will be mounted generally the spindle number in from 2 or 3 or even more are driven by one gear and is headed through the universal joint linkages and each spindle is mounted with a twist drill a uh, jig is used to guide the twist drill we can we have we will be using here a jig and these machine are mostly used in the continuous production shops where the several holes of same diameter or different diameter are to be drilled simultaneously and accurately so we can use these machines for continuous production shop where the several holes of same diameter or different diameter are to be drilled simultaneously and accurately then there is the automatic drilling machine the automatic drilling machine are production machines arranged in series to perform a number of different operations in sequence at successive work station now you might have seen the automated system in which yahan pe jo automation mein kya hoga the automatic drilling machines are produced production machines arranged in series to perform a number of different operations in sequence at successive work station from one station to another station the work pieces after completion of an operation at one station are automatically transferred to the next station for another operation thus it will works as a transfer line so the several drilling different operations like drilling boring tapping milling housing can be performed on a job in successive on this machines so in automatic drilling machine everything will be automated the transfer lines conveyor belts will be used or any transfer mechanism will be used and there will be proper positioning of the work piece under the drilling and accurate drilling will be done with the automatic drilling machine so this is all about the types of drilling machine in next lecture i'll explain about the drilling operations so this is it for today's lecture
थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर लिसनिंग मी केयरफुली हैव अ नाइस डे